Coming up on 20 minutes before 8 o'clock, 7.40 in the morning. There's a spike at WGN. Roosevelt Boulevard will slow you down a little bit this morning. Southbound side of Tyson Avenue. This is real life. This is radio. You just turn it on and it is there. Radio is so unique because it's accessible. It's an intimate and very personal medium. You can hear it in your car, or you can hear it in the kitchen, or even through new technologies. Hey, this is Taylor Swift, and want to listen to Radio Disney now? Then click this button for your music your way. Esto es ESPN Deportes Radio, solo deportes y solo en español. My listeners are everywhere, man. All colors, they're young, and they're old. It's amazing. These people listen to me 360 days a year. I'm not a celebrity to them. I'm their friend. Things that they advertise mainly is um, things that I will be into. They are tuned in, they are plugged in, they are paying attention. If we hear it on the radio, yeah. We'll definitely go and check it out on the website or something. You know, when I find great product, I want to share it. When you speak about particular products, they buy those products. Right. Radio is constantly reinventing itself. It's not just what goes out over the airwaves anymore, but also the connection that you can make with listeners through the web. When a listener hears a song they like, they simply press the tag button. Information about that song is captured by the HD radio receiver. Radio stations are a cultural focal point for the audience groups they attract. They cut across all of the demographic lines and at the same time have specific appeal to different groups of the audience. The easiest way to tap into the workaday lives of people anytime, any place, anywhere is through radio. Radio is heard here. Radio is heard everywhere.